Hi, my name is Talitha Lenehan. I am a writer and reporter for Speak Up magazine. And I live in South Pasadena, which is a neighborhood of about 25,000 people in Los Angeles County, about 10 miles northeast of downtown LA. So I'm on the main street in South Pasadena, Fair Oaks Avenue, and yes, there are some cars going up and down, but it's nothing compared to how it normally would be on a regular afternoon. I would say there's about 75% fewer cars on our streets these days, which is um, not a bad thing. This is a typical restaurant now in Los Angeles. As you can see, all of the chairs on top of the tables. Yeah, the restaurant is open. You can go in, you can order food and take it away. And they also deliver in many cases, but you cannot go and sit inside a restaurant anymore. That is something that is of the past for now. So just before the United States started to go into lockdown over the coronavirus, I actually flew across the country. I flew from Los Angeles to Miami, and that was quite an experience. Now, LA is home to one of the busiest airports in the world. However, when I went there, it was virtually empty, virtually no traffic, no crowds, no lines. And the airplane itself was similarly empty, around 75% empty, I would say. Um, so that was very bizarre. I'd never um, experienced travel quite like that before. Um, when I got to Florida, I headed to Key West in the Florida Keys. And almost as soon as I arrived, things began to shut down. Uh, starting with bars and nightclubs, they closed down completely. Restaurants remained open, but were only allowed to offer delivery and takeout. So you couldn't actually go and sit in a restaurant. Um, attractions started to close down while I was there. Tours were canceled. By the end of my stay, the local government ordered all of the beaches to close on the Florida Keys and they ordered all hotels to close and actually kick out any remaining guests. So we had to leave our hotel. We had nowhere to stay and we ended up buying new flights back to Los Angeles, which fortunately um, were very cheap, very affordable. We paid $28 each to fly from Miami to Los Angeles. That's almost 3000 miles. Um, and of course that's extraordinarily unusual. By the time I returned home, all of Los Angeles County was on lockdown. So what that means is that we are encouraged to stay home as much as possible. We are allowed to go out to go to the grocery store or the pharmacy, to exercise, to take care of a loved one, or of course, in the case of an emergency. Um, I'm at Garfield Park, which is very much at the heart of the community here in South Pasadena. So um, the park is still quite busy. Um, there are people out exercising, um, just you know, being in nature, spending time with their families, doing yoga and meditation, while of course maintaining safe social distancing at all times. However, the playground behind me, which would normally be full of children at this time of the day, is closed. Um, because of the coronavirus, all of the libraries in Los Angeles County are closed for now. However, here in South Pasadena, we have little free libraries, which look like this, where people can leave books and magazines for others to come and get. So it's a wonderful service, especially now. Things are definitely becoming more and more restricted as time goes on. Um, so anything really that um, encourages crowds and people to come together um, is being cancelled which is probably for the best.